just totally tell how God has been um, interweaving their story together and uh, how they're just so perfectly made for each other because they see the greatest in each other. Aside from Ivana's brother, Justin, who happily arranged their first opportunity to meet, at the gym, of course, the one who gets the most credit for bringing them together is God. Parker pursued Ivana with an official and chivalrous request for not one, but a series of dates. And it was during this time together that it was confirmed for Ivana what God had already shown her months before in a time of prayer, that this was the man God had picked out for her and that she would marry. What's more is that Parker knew this too, that he had finally found the woman that as a child he had only known to be a figment of his imagination, that he would pretend to search for and rescue like a valiant hero while riding his dirt bike around the hills and back roads of Tennessee. Parker and Ivana would like you all to know what this wedding ceremony, and even more so what their marriage, means to them. They want you to know that they wholeheartedly believe that their marriage will be bigger than just two people falling in love and spending their lives together. That they will be building more than a marriage, but building a kingdom. God is faithful in his provision. Parker and Ivana are not standing here at the altar by mere coincidence. God's hand has been leading their union together for the greater purpose of growing his kingdom. Symbolize the meaning of these roots and coming together to grow as one life in the Lord, Parker and Ivana will be potting a plant together in a very special mix that is being combined from soil that comes from Ivana's home of Peoria, Arizona and Parker's home of Jamestown, Tennessee. Marriage is not simply a legal contract, it is much more. It is a spiritual contract or covenant designed by the Creator Himself, the Triune God, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. It is a covenant not only between two people, but also between the two and God. Thus it should never be broken. And in the days ahead, may their marriage be weeded and watered so that compassion and kindness and humility grow. God, may their marriage be fertilized and fed so that gentleness and patience and forgiveness flourish. And may their marriage be rooted and established in love, a love that comes from you as its source, a deep life-giving love. Lord, may their life together be like a tree that brings shade and bears much fruit and is beautiful in ways that cannot now even be imagined. It is my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Parker, you can kiss your bride. Parker's such a loyal man. 
such a faithful man. When he says something, he sticks to his word, and he's so loving and kind, considerate of other people, always putting other people's needs ahead of his. I can't imagine uh, how you're going to bless everyone else around you being together now, and even more, <laughs> even more of a team than you guys already were, because you guys both have impacted my life in such a deep way. She's been my best friend. Um, we have so many memories. One couldn't even define Ivana. She has been there through for me through every stage of my life.